Hey Bob, it's me. Today, I want to do a video about the predictions of Fortnite in 2019. So, you may be saying, what what predictions? What, what, what can I predict about? It's, it's literally been like a week of, of the new year of 2019. Well, what can I possibly predict? Well, I can, I can speculate what can happen because, um, I speak very truthfully about this game. You know, I don't care about if I ever get Papa one day in Fortnite says, Hey, do you just want to, you know, go to our studios and try out our new game? Well, no, I don't care, but <laughs> with that out of the way, I want to truthfully say what 2019 is basically going to be. And I believe that my predictions are that they're going to run out of ideas. They're, they're already kind of scraping the, scraping, blah, 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 what am I talking about? Scraping the, the barrel, bottom of the barrel, you know, saying that this is going to happen. Because we're going to only see 7, 2018 had like six seasons, correct me if I'm wrong. And basically by season five, it like, it doesn't feel like they have any ideas anymore. And they have to constantly, because they need money, they're going to constantly like make up uh, like, skins, emotes, and need new ideas. You need new ideas for the battle pass. You need new ideas like, like season five with toys, and six was on the pets, season seven is, I don't even know what. Oh, this is a wrapping paper or whatever, I don't know. It's not interesting, really. <laughs> Seasons are gonna become unimpressive, and uh, it's gonna be, there's gonna be less and less hype. Already there's no hype for season seven, kinda like it's happened. I predict, I predict it's gonna keep happening for season eight, season nine, and so on and so, on and so forth. Six more seasons, I believe, in 2019. Correct me if I'm wrong, it's been, I'm predicting six or seven more seasons. That's what it was for 2018, there were six seasons. I don't know if season one was in 2018, I doubt it. I don't know if season, was season two in 2018? I don't, I, I think, yeah. But, I predict they're gonna run out of ideas, you know, they're gonna, cause they're already kinda doing it like that, that gnome skin. Like with season six, Foul Pass, it was all Halloween skins, so it's like, there's no other creativity item in there, and all the skins that came out, like a pumpkin skin, you know, you have all these type of skins that don't, <laughs> they don't, they're not inventful, like, it seems like something, oh, let's just create this as a skin, and have no thought into it, and just make it 2,000 V-Bucks, which, I'm not gonna spend 2,000 V-Bucks on the, on this pathetic skin, I want to I want to buy something that looks cool, but I don't think they're having those ideas anymore, maybe they will, I don't know, it could be, they could have a cool skin, but, I also predict the fandom is probably going to be destroyed in 2019, that's what I'm predicting because uh, people already hate this game more than I do. I believe the fandom is going to be destroyed in 2018 because um, uh, just over time because Fortnite is going to continue like they're not, they don't listen to the, the community, they don't listen to them. I believe back in like when they first started Fortnite back in 2017, people, they listen to people because the community is small ever since, you know, Fortnite exploded in popularity, I don't think they, they don't care about people's opinions anymore. What are they gonna add? They're gonna add whatever idea they have. You're just gonna add in there. It doesn't matter if it's gonna ruin the game. It doesn't matter. That's what people are probably gonna leave about. As long as you don't change the fundamentals of uh, of building or shooting, they're just gonna keep on adding things that are just gonna annoy it, annoy the main purposes. Like boom boxes, for example, are main reasons why a lot of a lot of pro tryhards are saying, "No, this is a piece of crap." Well, I say that's a pretty good idea. I'm not gonna build battles. Someone's just gonna pull a boom box down and destroy the build so they have to fight. All you fight me is still building a build battle because you don't need to build a castle in order to kill me. That's my opinion. <laughs> but that's why I like the boombox. A lot of people say they don't like the C4. I like the C4. Then when people, when they finally got rid of the C4, people were all happy. Then they added a dummy, which I like the dynamite. So then it didn't actually destroys the whole building. It's pretty cool. Large radius. So other people say, oh no, it's the same thing as C4. Yeah, but it's more cool. It is. <laughs> but, uh, what do you guys think? Do you think 2019 is going to be the year that Fortnite's going to be a story? I think it's going to be a dark time for Fortnite. It kind of already is. But it's gonna be a matter of time when we get up to like season 10. What's gonna happen in season 10? Oh, it's more, more crap. Same thing. It's gonna drive people crazy. It's gonna lead people to like a, a, a revolution. People are gonna storm into the Epic Games building, and they want more fun stuff, not not boring, you know, stuff. And people, people get, people are already bored of winning. They need something different that makes winning fun again. Or new strategies that put winning that you can win in a different way as I'm trying to say so that's all I have to say short video I'm gonna do these type of videos more often because um I'm still trying to figure out my audio glitch <laughs> my audio screwed up <laughs> but I'm gonna go now just to make this short video um if you want to support the channel then like and subscribe 
comment down what you think 2018 is going to be about Fortnite. Is it going to be the same dark, gloomy thing that I have predicted, or is it going to be happy, everyone's cheerful Fortnite? <laughs> Why don't we go now, so bye. Yeah, I confess, father, I confess.